According to the residents of the area, about seven trailers with a gate pass allegedly gotten from the general manager, Edo State Urban Water Board, enable a water engineering firm, Waterfront Development Limited, lift the pipes and accessories at Ikboba Dam. The residents alleged that upon interrogation of the drivers, they discovered that the water pipes have been sold to Waterfront Development Limited, Port Harcourt, by the state government. They lamented why the state government could sell the water pipes instead of putting them to meaningful use that we provide portable water to the populace. The ones in Kuba uh, Hill by the barrack are far more than what you have here. Now, somebody today have sold it for 350 million. Pipes that are worth over 10 billion. So if somebody cannot give use this thing to extend water to us, they should leave it there, they should not sell it. So that the next subsequent government will come and use it for us. Must we have a government who will be selling all what we have? Many things have been sold. Every reasonable government will want to uh, retain and manage their structure, what they have on ground, so that as to benefit the populace. I think it's not uh, to the benefit of Edo State and uh, we the indigenous that are living in Edo State. So I suggest strongly that anything that is being retained by the state government should be maintained for future generations. I don't like it. It's not a good idea for the state government to set the pipe. Let's restart it again. Let there be normal uh, water from the pipe as it was before. As the one seller, it's no good. Therefore, see leave and make the bring water for because sometimes you know they see light for the borehole. Therefore, see it's not do the tap again. Make the tap see the rush as before. The state urban water board general manager could not be reached to comment on the allegation. Patience, Osayomabo reporting.